My county, Western Kishu County, has already implemented that plan. And I'm sure you are somewhere between 45 to 50 percent in terms of how much goes to development. Honorable members, we all appreciate the fruits of devolution. However, 30 percent contracts for the youth and women and people living with disabilities have not yet been made by the county government. My office will work closely with the county assembly to enforce the constitutional requirements they are here to ensure county governments award contracts to the youth, women, and people with disabilities and other disadvantaged groups. As per the Public Procurement and Disposal Preference and Reservation Amendments Regulation Act of 2013. Honorable Members, Chapter 8 of the Constitution sets out Parliament as a legislative arm and it comprises the National Assembly and the Senate. The role of Parliament is clearly outlined in Article 94 as among other functions, A, manifesting the diversity of the nation, representing the will of the people, and exercising their sovereignty. Uh, we do have as well, uh, in terms of uh, uh, development, a uh, department of uh, roads, uh, infrastructure roads, and public works. I took a lion's share of around 695 million uh, for the 2015-2016, but uh, it also had around 316 million as carried forward from the 2014-2015. So it has a total of around 1.0 billion uh, in the Department of Roads and Public Work. That carries the lion's share. Uh, we do have also uh, more resources in the Department of Water, Environment and Natural Resources. We will have at least six million going to every ward for or for water supplies, uh, to connect pipes, for expansion, uh, and the like. So that is the Department of Water, uh, Environment, and Natural Resources. Uh, the departments that were allocated more funds uh, is actually the Department of Health when it comes to recurrent expenditure. Uh, it took a total of 1.12 billion for health in terms of recurrent expenditure 